I see an F function defined, a G function defined, and they're telling us that one of the following answers is equivalent to this. So I'm going to plug both of these in. I'm going to see what this graph looks like. And then all I have to do is plug in my answers until one matches it, right? So I pull up Desmos and I have my F defined and G defined for Desmos. Now I can just type in F of X divided by G of X and it's able to graph it because F and G are defined. Now, I don't want to get rid of these two functions because this relies on it, but I do want to hide the colors because I only care about this equation. Now, all I have to do is type in my answer choices until one of them match. Just for the sake of time, I'll skip to C and D. So in C, we have X times X minus three divided by X plus one. You can very clearly see that's not going to match our graph. And then all I have to do, and what's nice for a lot of these problems is I don't have to delete this and retype answer choice D. All I have to do is change this positive here. You can see, and if you want to double check if it overlaps, you can just click this color. You can see it's the same graph. Our answer choice is going to be D here.